Okay, so this is my Harbor Freight 10 by 17 tarp garage, tarp shed. Um, I've had out here for a couple years. Uh, we get lots of snowfall though, and last year the uh, the roof almost came in. Didn't want to lose, lose the space. So I come up with an idea. Run these two by fours down. They're 18 foot long, gives me a six inch gable on each end. Sheet across those two by fours and screw the roof right to them. And the two by fours themselves are held together held onto the roof with screws that go through the tubing. These two by fours are held on. Two by four, two by four, and then the third one runs the length. The only thing I would do different because the cap um, <clears throat> missed the two by fours at the at the crown at the peak. I would run those a little higher, a little closer to the peak, so that you can get that cap to pull into those two by fours. But other than that, and, and it's fine. It's it's tapped into the sheet metal below it. Um, where these straps are, they're keeping the thing from splaying out. I'm going to put um, two by fours. I'll bevel the edges and. I'll do another video. I'll set them on top and screw them through the bottom and uh, hold them on there. That'll hold the display on both sides. And it'll also allow me to uh, put some plywood up here and put some light duty things up on overhead. And then I'll take these ratchet straps. I don't know if you can see the end of the, the garage is, is listing to one side. I'm going to put an X brace with ratchet straps down down against that long end, that far end. But I think we got a winter here. I think this is gonna hold up this winter. Um, I think the snow's gonna come off just fine. And I'm gonna get some more life out of my, out of my little Harbor Freight tarp garage. I threw some sand in there and leveled it out just to uh, keep from walking in the mud.